Good day from Old World Soap Shop. I'm so happy you could join me again. Um, today I'm going to be making a wonderful, luxurious bar of soap and it's going to be scented with Pumpkin Party from Nurture Soap and Sandalwood Essential Oil and Fragrance Oil combination from Wholesale Supplies Plus. So, it's going to be a pumpkin and sandalwood and I'm so excited for it. I already have these little soap molds to to top them off these little pumpkins and then I also have gingerbread men and they're a little ashy but um, after the soap's done curing with these in I'll just take a steamer over and that'll take care of that they're so cute and again here's a here's a close up of the pumpkin so cute. So today I'll be using, uh, I'm going to be making 74 ounces, so just two loaves, about 18 bars, and I'll be using palm, coconut, olive, shea, and castor. Um, pumpkin party is going to be at 3%, sandalwood will be at 2%. So we'll see how it turns out. I'm not really exactly sure what I'll be doing for colors right now. Um, let me see. That's dragon's blood, wrong one, okay. So it has a zero, zero percent for vanillin, so that's good, there's no discoloration there. Let's see, for the pumpkin party, it has a one percent, so it might tan it a little bit, but no big deal. So there will be some kind of orange in here, I know for sure, and um, I'm gonna have to differentiate it between the pumpkin latte which I do have the espresso grounds in there but maybe I'll throw some green in also I don't know we'll see um oh and on that note of pumpkin I just wanted to share with you I'm drinking coffee right now and it has cream in it maple syrup pumpkin spice like the actual spice and cinnamon spice so ground pumpkin spice and ground cinnamon, and it is divine. I strongly encourage you to try this. It's like autumn in a cup, so wonderful. Okay, I'm gonna flip you around and we will get started. Okay, so here I am with um, my fragrance and the Kaylin Clay right here. I'm going to whisk it together a little bit. I've mixed my, I've poured my light solution into my oils. And I ended up going with a frosty white color, an evergreen, and a um, vibrant orange mixed with tangerine. And the colorants are from Wholesale Supplies Plus and Dibble Dabble. So, the frosted white is called Highlight White Gold Mica. And then Mai Tai Orange is the orange color from Wholesale Supplies Plus. And then Evergreen Green Mica is the green color from Wholesale Supplies Plus. The white color is also from Wholesale Supplies Plus. I'm not sure how the 
fragrance react, so I'm just gonna wait to divide it into these three containers. is this is definitely not a fragrance that speeds up traits or accelerates or rices or separates or anything like that. It's a beautiful fragrance combination. The Pumpkin Party from Nurture Soap and the Sandalwood from Wholesale Supplies Plus. I mean, I could go for quite a while. It's a beautiful, beautiful fragrance not causing any anything really. So I finished my soap, I've got my pumpkins in. I only have 10, so I'll be selling 10 of these bars with pumpkins. And, okay. sorry, I had to do math real quick. And eight of the bars without pumpkins. So um, that'll be fine. I have some more that I'm making over here. I was going to stick some of these gingerbread men in, but they aren't as nice looking as I want them to be. So I'll just end up giving them to my kiddos my glove rip so I'm gonna have to take these off and throw them away and then I'm gonna clean up my mess and I will cut these bars in a couple days and let you see the results thanks for watching all right good morning everybody it is two days later and I have these beautiful loaves to unmold and cut up and stamp today so I'm going to bring you along with me to do that
It's always so fun to hold a loaf, a whole loaf in your hands. Isn't that awesome? Okay. So I need to line it up in my soap cutter. And I always like to put the embeds that are sticking out closest to the top so I can see where the wires are coming down. And Of these little pumpkins so this mold I bought from wholesale supplies plus and there's 12 in all so I'm not gonna mold it and mold them all in front of you but I just wanted to show you what it looks like all right, so that is it for today. Thank you so much for coming along with me as I filmed this video on my pumpkin and sandalwood soap. I had so much fun. I hope it inspires you for fall and that you do something with it. Go make soap. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.